What up, what up? It's the Mike the FNG Collector, man. What's going on? So it's uh, it's another week, another haul, another new comic book day, and some back issue pickups. So, uh, wasn't a big week. Wasn't a big week. Um, uh, <clears throat> so a little something different. Uh, indies were actually one of the, the least amount of stuff I got in my pull box today. Uh, really the, the only one I got was uh, Red Room. This is, uh, I believe it's just the, the cover A. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what else you can say about Red Room that nobody hasn't already said. I mean, when it came out, kind of shocked everybody how, how, how kind of off the wall and gruesome it was. But, um, you know, uh, it's like watching a scary movie. You know, you don't watch it because that's the kind of shit you want to do. Watch it because it's like, whoa, what the fuck? So, uh, and uh, another new comic book day means there's another uh, Extreme Carnage uh, cover. So, this is another one of the Johnson Connecting covers. Uh, Agony. Uh, I think there's one or two more. Something like that. One or two more. Uh, so DC was actually the big winner for, for this week. This is the Batman Beyond book. Finally they bring Terry back for a little bit. I hope uh, they get to put him in some more stuff. Batman 89. Uh, unfortunately I've already seen all the spoiler stuff for it. And I've heard they, they went pretty woke. You know go woke go broke. Um, if I hadn't already ordered <laughs> the next the next covers I wouldn't have. Uh, and the Benacci, Benassi, uh, however you say his name, Joker cover. Um, I liked what he did with the Venom, so I kind of dig his art. It's uh, kind of twisted and tormented. Cool stuff. Uh, I hope they, they get to something, hope they're building to something pretty big. Uh, it's been 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 kind of kind of chill little too chill but uh so light week i picked up some stuff off the wall uh darker image uh uh that seems to be a staple in in, in most people's in most people's uh uh boxes uh this one i've never seen this before uh so this is is a uh, a combo of Big Trouble Little China and Escape from New York. You get two for the price of one. Uh, and uh, I don't know, I just thought it was cool. I, uh, I saw that darker image and I picked it up and they had that one for pretty cheap. So I was like, meh, meh. Let me go ahead and get that. Uh, when I was a little kid, Big Trouble Little China was one of my favorite movies. So, uh, I had to get it. Uh, well, actually, that's it, man. Um, uh, I've been. I had to go back to Unknown Comics for uh, FOCs, and um, and they just take forever. So I just I'm not, I haven't been getting stuff in the mail. Uh, there's something you know they put shipped on it. Yeah, uh, it yesterday wednesday something like that so it'll probably ship out actually ship out sometime next week uh, anybody that's ever bought from unknown comics knows how that shit goes um but they they do that 30 percent discount so it's it's hard to beat them uh uh man if anybody knows anybody else that that throws that 30 percent discount and ships ships good and ships quicker <laughs> And hit me up in the comments. Let me know. Uh, other than that, let me know what you think. Uh, uh, anybody, anybody else feel like uh, the Joker has, has been kind of a lame duck? Uh, I, I know the the uh, the Joker issue that's on FOC this week. You know, has a picture of uh, Bane's daughter. You know, holding holding Joker up. 
by his by his collars. Uh, so hopefully that means there's gonna be some more action. Uh, so far it's been a bunch of bunch of bullshit. Um, not a bad story, just you know you're expecting a story with uh, with Joker to have cool cooler shit in it. I know it's mostly about uh, Commissioner Gordon. Uh, but anyways, that's enough for that, all that BS. So that's about five minutes. That man said that's all I got. So uh, yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Later, player.